Hey guys, it's uh, Pat D's. Welcome to the channel. I am doing the flea market today. And the big question I have is where is Taco Stacks? I drove an hour to come down, not to see Taco Stacks, but usually Taco Stacks is actually somewhere in this area. He's not here today. So maybe he's somewhere else and they were worried about the rain. I was worried about the rain. We were gonna do uh, Dixon City, uh, which is about 20 miles from where I live for tomorrow. And they only do Sundays. Problem is it's gonna rain all day tomorrow. And I already had the truck. So to come here today to the Blue Ridge flea market, uh, about 300 bucks so far. So we've been here, we got here at uh, about 10 of six. So we've been here, what, what time is it, did you say, Josh? 7.50. So we've, we've been, oh, 7.50? Yeah, we've been here two hours. And um, we sold some stuff. I mean, I'm giving such good deals on some stuff. Here, show some of this stuff I just sold. How you doing? So all this stuff here in the boxes, these five boxes, they sold for 100 bucks. Yeah, blank, B, C, I, T. No, no, no. You need to work at the pizza place, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, for Pete. Yeah, long time. Yeah, ago. I, I live up. There, yeah, long time ago. Yeah. Um, I live up in uh, east of Scranton. Oh really? Yeah, I remember you. Huh? He's yeah, he's been trying to sell it. Yeah, three hundred thousand. Yeah. Hey, nice seeing you. That guy remembered me from twenty-five years ago when I worked at a pizza place. Is that is that on? Can you see my face? Um, that guy remembered me from when I worked at a pizzeria for twenty-five years ago. This this flea market actually is almost close to my hometown. It's only like six miles away, so. It's uh, nice to come here, but it's a drive. But uh, I had a little bit of an issue uh, with, uh, I was, I'm about, I'm about a foot over on, on my space, but um, she said, I'm gonna let it go, but uh, I had to keep an eye. Um, so I got my pass to be here today. We're doing okay. You know, it's, it's gonna be one of those things. We gotta move some bulk things, so. Hi guys. Yeah, so again, I went to recap. I sold all these boxes to one guy for a hundred bucks, and um, it's clearly about four hundred dollars worth of stuff. But you know what? I have to move stuff. I have. Uh, I'm all set up here. Oh. Okay. So we we sold a bunch of stuff already. Sold cat food, cat litter, but um, doing all right. I'm hoping to do six to eight hundred dollars today. I'll let you guys know how I do. But that's the U-Haul. So, and you can see there's a lot of empty spaces actually. How you doing, boss? Josh, you can sit down if you want. So, we have a lot set up here and some things I don't even care to give it such a good deal because of the truck. Is the dust bag. That's like five bucks. But uh, two fifty, they're two fifty brand new. Yeah. But you know, you can always make an offer. Okay. And 
it, it slides and yeah, it, it angles a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Is, uh, you're doing a lot of crown molding. I was going to put it up on Facebook Marketplace. I said, ah, let me bring it here today and see. Yeah. Josh, what time is it? So here's the truck, and we had it, we had it full. Honestly, um, just to get rid of stuff, we got we we. The more we get rid of here today, the less that we have to take back. So that's the goal. All right, um, I'll update you guys. I don't want to burn up the GoPro, uh, and we'll we'll see what happens. I'm gonna take a walk through. All right, guys. We're gonna walk around and see uh, see what's up. See what this guy's. See what everybody else is selling. The weather's not too bad today, and actually, I've been keeping pretty busy. Got a lot of shoes. There you go. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. The Pocono pickle guy. I just bought your pickles at Weiss. Did you? Yeah. Which one? The garlic one. No, what Weiss? Uh, Hamlin. That's, Hamlin. That's where I live, yeah. Yep. We were going to do uh, the circle tomorrow, the Dixon City, mm -hmm. but with the rain. Yeah. So then we came down to, uh, today. Yep. So. Yeah. 
How's things going? All right. Yeah. I was. That's nice to get into a store like that. Yeah. Because that gives you uh, smooths over the uh, the winter. Yep. That's yeah. It. Yeah. How long you been doing that now? The stores. Stores? Oh, about five, six years. Oh, really? Yeah, I've been in a lot. I've been in the stores for a long time. Oh, okay. That's the first time I noticed them. So. Yeah. I'm selling today. You selling? Good. Yeah, yeah. All right. You. you got to go they were uh, they were driving by. Uh, someone was hollering for you, and you just kept going. When? Oh, I don't know. Early, early this early morning. Early this morning. This way? Was it your husband? It might have been my husband. Yeah, it was. I think he was trying to show you something. Oh. Did you see and, that fire? And I uh, tune it out. And, I said, <laughs> and he said, "Oh, I said, oh, I know Vanessa." And yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Might have been him. I don't know. All day, people. It's either Ma, 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 or Vanessa. Vanessa yeah. Vanessa. So what's for sale? Thank you, baby. Oh, I don't know. I, I got a bunch of these. I... This is smart. Very smart. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's very smart. Even when you I... follow him on Whatnot? He's a big Whatnot guy. Are you? I think I've seen you. Yeah. yeah. What's your name on it? Pat D's. Pat D's. Yeah. My daughter started going I was online. looking for taco stacks, but they said, no, he don't come on Saturdays. Uh, he's early, early yeah, in the morning straight, it, yeah. and he only stays for like two hours. Yeah. yeah. Hey, guys. What, what, <laughs> oh, man, I forgot his thing. Pat D's, like Rick D's, P-A-T-D-E-E-S. Hey, hey, God, you're walking. <laughs> talking. You all right? I'm okay. How you doing? Did you see my, my thing yesterday? My, my party at Christmas? What did you find? We were Mexicans. The <laughs> Donald Trump game. There we go. Lassie. I feel fairly normal when I'm sitting. Not doing anything. When I start moving, okay, okay, okay. did you find it? Okay, I noticed yeah. it. No, did you I find it? You're not, you're not busting my chops today. No, I already did. You didn't hear it. <laughs> oh, you did? She said, Patty, then I came out of nowhere. These nuts. I wish I knew you were going to do that. I'm going to tomorrow, so I'm going to put your thing over. I have something. I'm going camping. I don't know. There's a market for anything because you bought them. Promised Land State Park? Yeah, no, I just thought they cool. Very nice. Yeah. My son's over I watching know. the stand so now. We sold, said that, hey, sweetie, said we sold uh, a lot of pallet stuff. Oh, yeah, that's what. I'm not thinking about it. So they're like, they like what do you have today? Well, like, uh, the pallet uh, stuff. Eating and the like bear walk right yeah, over the, we have a, a big U haul. Oh, that makes me very uncomfortable. Over usually where Taco Stacks is. So I said, I'll have the portable. Yeah, we're up around. throw the shit at But we're not far. I need somebody to watch my skeleton. Yeah. I wanted to talk so to you before when you were. I was gonna message you, but then my I got in an accident. Oh. I got T bone and destroyed my car. Oh jeez, are you all right? Yeah, I got a nice scar. Oh my gosh. Two hours away. There's that. Oh. I told her that when I was the husband of Trump. Yeah. My husband told me to tell everybody that it was him. Um. No, I wanted to see if. Uh, you said you get CBS stuff in. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Hey, you can always even message me. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I want to see. Leslie videos. You got it. Is that, is that you got all you do is do pallet stuff or do you do other things? No, no, I do storage units, all kinds of things. We came down here today because it's supposed to rain tomorrow, so I didn't go to the circle. Yeah. yeah. So. Oh, you didn't you didn't trick me. All right, I'm going to walk back up. You just reach out to me when you need anything, all right? See you, Vanessa. I will see you soon. Have a yep, good one. You too. How you doing? Good, how are you? Could you use a sign like that? No. But 
thank you. <laughs> I got a whole two cases of them. Yeah? Yeah. You could put your paper right on it. I could. How much are you charging for them? $3. Then I'll take one. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Look at you. Yeah, when I sip all my stuff out, I do that. Can I have $3, please? I'll take it. Yeah. What should I use, like a dry erase marker? No, what I would do is to, to keep it up, I would do, you see how you have this piece yeah. of paper? Just put it right here. But it's gonna stand out better. Yeah. And then if you wanna switch it, that's what I would do. I even have a Cricut I could actually put. Yeah. I could print it out. It just, you know, it, it looks nice. Yeah. And you know, foam board, that's not mm -hmm. like cardboard, it's gonna hold up. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. I appreciate it. Where's okay. your daughter at today? She is actually working. She works at CVS. Yeah, you were telling me. So, um, yeah. she works today, so I brought my son. Oh, okay. Is she treating you good? Ooh. Mom! Yeah. Oh, he's like, who? <laughs> I thought you meant he, my Yeah, he thought you meant his sister. Oh, no, his sister, that's a different, that's yeah. a different love. Exactly. You know? Okay, folks, that's the end of the flea market, but now, as you can see in the truck, we did clear a lot of stuff out. This truck was filled all the way to the end. So uh, we, we sold, I, I would say, about 40% of the truck and uh, did, did actually very well. But with that being said, um, I sold the saw for 100, one in 150, but you know how that goes. I sold the table and the box for 100. I sold like four boxes of toy stuff, kid-related stuff for 100. And one person got another box, a couple things, and three cases of cereal, and that was a hundred. So there was four hundred dollars from four customers. Um, so now we're here back at the store, Trude. My son's filming. I'll, I'll show you. We'll pan in there real quick. So this is the location that is um, close to my house. The only difference is there's no cameras here, but they have they have like an alarm system that the door opens if you don't have a special key. It sounds an alarm, and the lip uh, is you got to be very careful because you could trip over and there's no light in there so I know everyone's curious and I don't really totally know how much I did so I'm gonna give you a rough estimate I got two pocket pulls of money here I actually left an hour early I left at uh, 1 30 because someone uh, a friend of mine messaged me and uh he bought a pallet of uh returns that were mailed i guess from amazon walmart fedex and um he tagged me last night i'm like okay yeah so he sent me the money and i said okay but i'm gonna make a video about it he's like that's all right and son of a gun did i not i missed it and uh, they were there people were there at 10 o'clock in the morning and I, I had messaged them and said i'd be and they, well there's no holds but uh, I get there, boop, already sold out. They sold 43 at 250 bucks a piece. So I started um, roughly in, um, I had $25 in my pocket um, in fives and ones. And then I, the ones I had in, these, this bulk of ones I had in my pocket uh, to start the day. So that was my, the funny thing is, I didn't need as much money as I thought to start the way that it worked out. But I got two po so I got two pockets full of money, and I'm gonna quick count here, rough estimate. Uh, what do I? What, I did better than I thought, um, but I'll tell you, it's I'm tired. Um, me, I only slept about an hour and a half last night. It is almost three o'clock when I'm filming this, and. I'll tell you, if I had gotten this truck around 5, 6 o'clock at night, we could return this tonight and be okay. But because of the time, if you go an hour over, you pay a whole day. So I, I'm going to utilize the truck either late tonight or early tomorrow morning and um, finish emptying the one storage unit over there and um, condense it down to another storage unit that's about four units away. So that will save me about 160 bucks in that unit so that was really why i did it keep in mind it cost me to drive back and forth on the miles at 89 cents a mile uh it was roughly 75 bucks in miles it'll be about 40 dollars in gas so 115 and then 40 so it was about 165 and then 20 so I was saying 250, 275. It was about 200 and um, 
let's say $30 roughly to go down to that. Um, so here's the first pile of money. I know people always say, well, how'd you do? So you'll see that uh, when you're watching the video too, I walked around just to kind of take a little bit of a break while my son watched the stand and uh, just to kind of see. And I sold actually a sign to another vendor and they came up and bought something else. So this is the big, usually what I do is when I start getting some big bills, I, I keep a separate area hidden and, and um, I put the, the money in there. So approximately, and you see I skimmed through the money pretty fast, I did a little over $1,050. Uh, that was pretty good. I, I wanted to do six, $600 to $800 worth of dollars. I'm paying the price though. I'm tired. And I was going to stop and have a chicken sandwich on the way home. And we went to that uh, liquidation uh, place and we didn't get what I was supposed to get. And uh, the way the road was, I said to hell with it, let's get this stuff home and get it unloaded so that we could um, finish the video and I'm uh, probably gonna go home and ra eat a little bit and rest because I haven't eaten uh, all day so alright guys I hope you liked this video I am gonna be doing the flea market more this summer and um, my name is Pat Dees the traveling picker and I buy and sell things and, and uh, hope you like that video comment below and tell me what you think